Hello there. Thanks for taking the time to click on this video. And if you clicked on this video, you're probably curious about these drift waders. Now I've owned drift now for about a month and a half. And I want to tell you a little bit today about my experience. I've owned Hodgman, Fraud Tog, Sims, and now Drift. So I have firsthand experience in a lot of years of fishing about what's, what's different about Drift. So why is Drift now the best wader that I've ever owned? And we're going to talk a little bit about that today. First and foremost, storage is awesome in these drift waders. It's got pockets for warmers here. It's got storage up front where I just happen to have a box of flies that I just, or, or a tin of flies that I just bought at the local fly shop. I got more storage on this side, which I just happen to have some cough drops. You never know where you need those. It's got another hand warmer side on here. And inside it's got these great big pouches to where I have an extra battery for my cell phone in case it starts running out of power. As you knew, I'd do a lot of filming. You can put your wallet in there. There's a waterproof case in case you have something you don't want to get wet if God forbid you fall in, but it has a ton of storage and that is far different than anything else out there on the market today. It's well thought out as far as storage goes. So now let's talk about comfort. Now these things have been super comfortable. A lot of times I don't even remember that they're on. They don't pull down on my shoulders. They're super comfy. They've got long legs for people that are tall. They also have XL normal sized legs. So people that are not as tall as I am feel comfortable in these waders. You always feel like the joints where you're walking and when you're moving is in the right spot. Very ergonomic, great design on these waders. And they've got waders for both men and women. They're not unisex, right? Because we know that we're not we're not all created equal when it comes to how we're built. And they've got specific waders for women. And I've had some people comment on this video right here that talks about how comfortable they are for both genders when you have gender specific waders. So good on them for not just making a one size fits all. They have really put a lot of thought into waders and making sure they fit the specific angler. So love that about Drift. So let's talk about durability now. I've had a lot of fishing trips with this. I've walked through some brush, I've climbed over logs, I've had things poke into them, I have stickers poking into them. I've had a few close calls that I went down and let, oh no, hopefully everything's okay. Not a scuff, not a leak, nothing. And that I can tell you is a differentiator, right? They've got five layers down below to help protect you, right? And they're double and triple seamed on the seams. So if anything pokes into them, you really have to get into something ultra mega sharp to pierce these waders. So they're very, very tough if you do a lot of bushwhacking or if you're doing a lot of walking around with sticks and everything else, they are puncture resistant to a high degree. So I put them through the test and they passed the test absolutely. So these waders are also very safe and I really do appreciate that, that Drift has put the time and energy in developing something that really is a very safe wader. I have firsthand experience of a friend that fell in with another brand of waders and they filled up immediately because there wasn't enough things, enough features on that particular waders to help mitigate water from penetrating immediately if God forbid you're, you fell in, right? So these have three points of contact for your wading belt. It also has a drawstring on top that you can tighten everything up. So if you do fall in, it takes a while for water to start getting in. You'll get a little bit in, but it's not gonna balloon out immediately and you're full of water and now you're pinned to the bottom of the river. So these are very, very safe waders, which I appreciate that type of innovation that goes into designing waders. Love that. So why did I choose Drift? The first reason was is because they're a family owned company and I wanna support family owned businesses. Second, I have a lot of friends who own Drift waders, and just take take a look at this video I did right here, and I think it might be over here. This video I did right here when I did the unboxing, take a look at the comments of all the people that own Drift, right, for years. There is not one negative comment about Drift. Everyone talks about how much they love the waders because they have built a quality wader for an affordable price. These are just as good as any other wader out there that, that are pushing $1,000 in price point, and you don't pay that much for them, right? They're half the cost. So there are a lot of solid reasons why to choose Drift that we covered in this video. And I can save you a little bit of money as well. I'm a pro ambassador for Drift now, and you can save 5% on your next waiter if you use my coupon code, FlyFishDan. And it's actually good for anything on their website. You can save 5%. And if you buy a pair of waiters, they'll also send you a free gift, which is a fleece type of buff 
that might come in handy this winter and fall. All right. Well, I hope that helps you choose your next pair of waders. If you're new to fly fishing and you need a little help with your fly fishing cast, check out this video right here. I put five easy steps to follow that'll help improve your cast. I'm pretty sure after watching this, you'll cast your line just a little bit further. All right, everybody, until the next time, fish on.